As we move into this new, very bizarre realm of uh, AI and now quantum computing, I had a conversation with someone last night who was explaining to me how cryptography and encryption and all this stuff is literally on the verge of being obsolete and that this is going to put the financial markets into a chaos, uh, all, all your passwords, everybody's email, everything is out the window. There's no more encryption. It's not, it's not even going to be possible. These things are solving. Mark Andreessen explained it this way, that these quantum computers are solving equations that if you took every atom in the universe and converted it into computing power, the time it would take to solve these equations would be longer than the time that the universe would exist before it died of heat death. Yep. And they're able to do it in minutes. So the concept is, and this is where it gets super weird, that this is proof of the multiverse because these computers are using the computing power of perhaps infinite parallel universes simultaneously to achieve these answers. Which is like, what are you saying? <laughs> like, what, what the fuck did you just say? Did you, you, did you just say that if you took every molecule in the universe and converted it into computing power, it wouldn't be able to do this? This thing that you have in a fucking warehouse somewhere? That this thing has more computational power in this, it's like as big as this room, than the fucking universe, if it was a computer? What are you saying? Like, and you're saying this is the proof of the multiverse? Like, what does that even fucking mean? And what happens if China gets this online? If, if we're able to do these like equations, right? It's kind of almost like proof of concept of the technology being efficient or efficacious.